That little bop, Kim Kardashian, huh? So they, him and, I mean, her <laughs> and Kanye West came to an agreement for 200 bands, right? So somebody that has the pockets of Kim Kardashian felt that, you know, it wasn't enough that she should slay her husband for some more of it, right? And see... And, and this is what I tell a lot of men. It don't matter who you, you know what I mean? The people always, they teaching, oh, lead with your pocket. Lead with your wallet. Get, get the bread, get your body right, and then go get the women. Well, a lot of people that got their bread right and their body right is going through things such as this. You know, you see, as I read that 50 Cent book, he said, I dealt with a lot of women. You know, I wanted to figure out, is the woman here for 50 or for Curtis? And the more success that I achieved, the harder it was, the harder it was to choose. The harder it was to try to figure out was their intentions pure. And that's why I always recommend, yo, if you're going to find, if you plan on getting married, which it seems like these days, man, I don't recommend, only recommend marriage without the piece of paper. So it seems like if you want to get married with that piece of paper, you need to find it early on in the days, man, where it hurts, the days where you on the grind, the days where you ain't got nothing. That's probably the best chance that you will find. And even that, is wishy-washy because she could have been plotting on you for the job. She could have seen your potential and be like, man, when he get on, I'm going to go ahead and break apart and milk this man for what he got. So, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, right, especially today's times, it seems like marriage is a losing deal. Now, I know you didn't heard that before, but it really is. It seems like it's a losing deal. What's the benefits of marriage that you receive as a man? You know, yeah, you, if you want kids, yeah, you, you, at least I will hope, you know, cause that ain't even guarantee. They said get married you, to raise a family. You don't even need to do that. You and a woman need to be on one accord. They like, yo, we're going to raise it together. And this is what we're going to do. You don't got to be married for that. What's going to be the difference if you marry and if he wasn't married, if y'all on one accord, all it is is just recognized by the state. A lot of men work so goddamn hard to get to where they got. And then only for a woman to just come in the picture and decide that she don't want to be there and take and take from you what you were put in that she didn't put in. And that's why I always say, put these women to work. Make them earn it. A lot of them feel entitled that they deserted. Man, Kanye, man, Kanye was Kanye before Kim came in the picture. And I don't even understand why Kanye would even want to marry somebody like that, let alone have a child. You know, this is the same woman that was on that was that made us that made a sex tape intentionally with Ray J. That's a type of quality woman. Everybody in the world know what your bra look like underneath them clothes and what she do in them sheets. You know, she's a bop. And you chose to marry her and it wasn't for no business purposes because you're losing in this. You're losing in this situation. 200000 a month? I don't care how rich you are. That's an L. That's an L. And then not only that, you don't get to raise the kid or the kids. No longer in a two-parent home. And she about to be breaking herself to somebody else. With the 200000 that you pay monthly. Huh. Somebody else get ready to take the benefits of what you pay. 
because you chose to be crazy enough to marry somebody like that. That's why I say, man, look, man, look who you're dealing with, marriage or not. I know a quality woman is hard to come by these days, it seems like, you know? They out there, but it's but it's but it's not in the surplus. You're gonna run into a whole bunch of Kim Kardashians for sure. You're gonna run into a whole bunch of Kim Kardashians for sure. But that don't mean you gotta deal with them, no. So Kanye brought this on himself. Right? Kim got pockets. He, Kim seen him as a lick. So she licked him. She taxed him. Why not increase my earnings? Why not? Go, man, Kanye's a lick. Let me go ahead and add some more to the pockets. You know? I'm pretty sure she planned that. I'm pretty sure she planned that. And she succeeded. She must have been greedy. Because if you came to a settlement of that, she probably wanted some more of it. Watch who you deal with, y'all. These women is out for what you got. Not for who you are. And y'all need to know how to deal with these women. Y'all need to know what to deal with and what not to deal with. That's why the hell y'all need to go out here and sub to this channel. You know, soon as I upheld my standards, had higher standards, not only for myself, but who I'm dealing with. My dealings with women has changed drastically. And you don't need no money to deal with them. You're lame if you think you need pockets to deal with a woman. You're lame as hell. You're lame. And you wonder why the little broke boys is smashing your broads. You got to, you know, it ain't, it, just because you got some money, that don't make you a man. A woman can get some money. That don't make you no man. A man does what a woman can't do. Remember that. So why are you dealing with these Kim Kardashians get ready to get a lick? All these people that got money, Kanye West, Bill Gates, all these NBA players, NFL players getting licked. Huh. Curry next. But y'all want to go ahead and get your pockets right. You only get your pockets right so you can give more money to the broad. Come on, man. But anywho, man, y'all like, comment, and subscribe, man. We out.